also made them give these two to Ahmednagar. So, all in all, Vijayanagar lost four provinces. And they lost an alliance, too. And they're no longer protecting Malabar. Oh, they're allied with Malabar. Oh. Interesting. Don't need to protect them if you're allied with them, I guess. Stop being my rival. Come on. We can be pals. I wish we could afford some freaking advisors. Shit. They cost a lot, though. We're actually almost able to get a military tech upgrade. That'll do uh, land morale and a rampart. Cool. Oh my god. Oh, we have no morale. We can't even move our fucking soldiers. That's so stupid. Why do they let you lower morale so far that you can't move your units? You should at least be able to move your units. Come on. Nobles want pensions. Uh, national tax or stability? Well, national tax. <laughs> We're not worth much anyway. I'm sure we make more on trade than we do on tax. Please move. Move. You still can't move. <laughs> oh, it's so sad. Let's get another claim on Vijayanagar. Because why not? And how long do we have on these? Ten years? Yeah, ten more years. All right. We've got rebels, too. Vagina Gar Rebels, yeah. That'll happen. Okay, everybody go home. Time to chill. And you can go back to doing your thingamabobber. Patrol. Oh, I guess we can raise the maintenance a little bit so you don't die. There you go. Bring that down. Perfect. Let's repay some loans. Look, we repaid all of them. But because we took six loans of one ducat, that gave us 0.6 inflation. That's so retarded. <laughs> one ducat loans. Yeah, you're right. They may help me with Venata coaching. Let's take a look. Nope. Come on, click away. Nope. So they'll still join on their side, unfortunately. Uh, what are their relations at? They're probably all at 200, because we all stuck in that war to the end. That's usually how it works. Uh, sort by relation? Uh, friends. There you go. No, we're the, we're the highest. 200. But uh, they're 195, 198. Yeah, they won't help us against them. Damn it. Damn it. That would be cool, though. Oh, wow, these rebels are totally going to win. They just destroyed Orissa's army. Cochin broke their alliance with Orissa. Um, so you have no allies. Um. Um. Implication. Build a unit. Fund the troops. Everything at once. Do, the, do all the things. This one. Maintenance. Everything maintenance. Um. Um. Merge, get on the boat. We can't. We don't have morale to get on the boat. Declare war. Oh my god. Will you help me, Arissa? No, they still won't help me. They're just total dicks. Fuck. Well, when else are we going to have a chance to do that? Can we uh, get access? Nope. Can we get access through Vinod? Nope. Access through you? Nope. Fuck. We're going to have to attack from the water. Still don't have any morale. We can't even go anywhere. Okay. Can we call you to war? Why not? War exhaustion. Oh, they have too much war exhaustion. So they won't help. They won't help either side, even if they, um... Whatever. That's fine, I guess. All right, we can move now. That's good. Uh, but um, 
I think we're going to wait for full morale. Because they're going to have full morale. Might as well. I wish we had some more transports, though. And I wish we had access through either Vinod or uh, one of these idiots. Still has He still has me as a rival for some damn reason. Fucking hell, man. Try to be nice to you, and you're like, nope, rival. 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 Ooh, look at Ming. Ming just fucking ripped the shit out of uh, Tibet. Damn. Poor Tibet. Free Tibet. Ooh, Moderate Nationalists. You may get a new nation spawning out here if these uh, Moderate Nationalists are successful. We have high revolt risk. Why? War exhaustion? <sighs> yeah. Deal with that, please. Wow. That was a lot of war exhaustion. There goes all our fucking diplomatic points. Oh, well. Seslavis. In the meantime, we have, what, full, almost full morale. Hurry up. 2.07 is the f max morale. It's not the best. 1.9. We'll just wait for full. We actually have four units here now. Uh, I wish we could forward another cog. How much are they? Why don't you tell me how expensive they are, you stupid... What is the point of this? Why does it not show you how... Ex it says not enough ducats, but it doesn't tell you how many ducats it costs. Why doesn't this m window show you how much they cost? God damn it. Uh, what's this? Lose admin power, lose ducats, yearly prestige goes up, or just... No, 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 no. We're not going to lose two ducats. That's that's all our money in the world. Come on, how much is a cog? Seriously. That stupid window should show you. I know they show you here. It's uh, 12 ducats. All right. This is hilarious. I'm, I'm tempted to save up 12 ducats. In fact, I think I will. Here. Stop funding everything. We're going to save up 12 ducats, and then we're going to go... Then we're going to go drop our dipshits off. <laughs> uh. yeah, not even close. So, some of this stuff is going to flip back over to... Oh, our Navy's under attack. Oh, shit! Why, what are they... Did you got? Oh my god, these guys are... I merged my cogs with my... With my trade protectors, and apparently they all merged into trade protection mode. I don't want that. Fucking hell, dudes. Just go the fuck home. Actually, they're gonna win now. Yeah, kill him. Come on, he's, he's almost dead. Kill his one boat. Yeah, he didn't kill him, though, but whatever. Stop being in trade protection mode, you ass. What an ass. Well, we got claims on both of these. That's nice. Now, we're not going to take a dozen loans, because that's way too many um, bump bumps to the interest. You know what I mean? God, this is annoying. <laughs> this whole start is so frustrating. At least we made a good buddy. We have a buddy. Probably a buddy for life. Arissa's going to be our pal. Until we actually do successfully take one of these two provinces, because then they will hate our guts because we'll border them. But until they hate us, they'll be our buddy. Yay, buddy! All right, let's put the speed up until we get some money for a boat. Money for a boat. Stop funding my boats. Johnny R collapsed. Yep, 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 yep. So we have claims over here on these morons. I would love to declare war on you, but... Um, actually... Oh, you are... He just spawned, and he's already hostile towards me. Jesus Christ. He just spawned, and he's like, well, I hate your guts. You're right next to me, so I must hate you. He's Tamo? Hmm. Interesting. Well, we'll keep our options open. Actually, uh, Arissa might help us in that war. Probably not, though. No, Arissa's got too much shit going on. They can't even kill their own rebels. They have 1,000 dudes. Yeah, Arissa's fucked right now. Well, look at Mysore. They got this. Vijayanagar is down to two provinces. Bijapur and Mysore. Oh, no, this is all Bijapur. Bijapur got all three of these. That's weird. Whatever. They are so fucking fractured. I've never seen a nation 
that fractured when they spawn. That's crazy bad. Alright, so he's selling off some dudes. He's down to 5,000. Yeah, because he doesn't really have the economy here to support that many dudes. So we'll let him do what he wants. Alright, 11 ducats. Almost there. Give me 12, baby. Alright, can we afford it now? Yeah. 200 days. All right. Almost a year. <laughs> Am I a tech ahead of the coaching in war? Yes, we are. We have better tech than they do. So we have better morale than they do. That's good. I'm going to keep an eye on these guys. I hope they don't get any alliances. Carnet Carnetic nationalists. Interesting. I wonder if they would join Madurai. They probably would. I hope not, though. Still no ally, eh? Still hate us, eh? <laughs> they really hate us. <laughs> Man, that sucks for Arissa. They worked so hard. They worked hard to get that peace deal, and they're gonna lose everything they just got. Oh well. Not my problem. You didn't give me what I wanted. Alright, fund the military, fund the navy, hurry up, get your morale up, you little shitholes. Hurry up. More. More. More! Alright, that's good enough. Go. Kill everything! Die, you Hindu scum! God, that's a long way to walk. Rolling ones and zeros. That's great. I told you this leader sucked. He's zero one zero zero. <laughs> it's terrible. We're still gonna win, though. There you go. Alright, now we can just siege him down. No, we can't. We don't have enough troops. <laughs> can't even siege him down. <laughs> oh, we can't even siege him down. That's so bad. Arissa has collapsed. Yeah, so uh, what happened? Carnatic? Okay. And who are you? Golconda. Interesting. Kind of weird. Uh, let's see if we can buddy buddy with. No, you guys are. Why are you hostile towards me? We... They just spawned and they're already hostile. Everyone's hostile towards us. Jesus Christ. Even Bijapur is hostile towards us. At least a Mednagar is not hostile. God damn. Everyone's just so angry with Ceylon. Oof. Well, Arissa, get your shit together because I need you in a war. Gokanda sold one of its provinces. Oh, not to Madurai! Shit, so Madurai got stronger because Golconda just sold him that province. God damn it. <sighs> I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to start impressing these fuckers. No, it didn't work. If Vijayanagar can't be impressed, then I don't think anyone who's hostile with us will ever stop being hostile. We're going to have to find someone who is not hostile. And that's really far away. You have to go all the way to Ahmednagar, which is just so it's too far. Damn, we have, like, nobody who can rely on. This sucks. I need a friend. I need a pal. Oh, well. Let's fabricate claims on your dumb ass. No, we can't. We already have two. I guess that's enough. That's what she said. All right, now we can siege. We actually have 2,000 guys. Now we can siege. So now we can lower the funding again. To, like, nothing. See, that sucks because now Madurai is going to have a better economy. They're going to get up to like seven or 8,000 troops. And I was kind of hoping they wouldn't. Oop, tech up our admin tech. What's this going to get? Allows to support foreign rebels and production efficiency, 
That'll help. Uh, we're getting how much from production? Well, we're getting more money from production than we are from taxes. So, great. And we're getting more from trade than from anything else. We should probably focus on trade tech. My goodness. Everyone's declaring war on Cochin. Well, I got here first, dumbass. Totally got here first. I wonder if you would help me against Vinod. That'd be nice. No, they're currently... Oh, they joined Vinod against Cochin. But they wouldn't join me against Cochin. Oh, probably because we're Buddhist. Man, they're mad. You mad, bro. Take that, you sack of shit. Uh, next, you dumbass. Blammo. Alright. Ah, oh, that feels great. Ceylon has a foothold on the peninsula, baby. Aw, oh, shit. Uh, we don't have enough for a core. Uh, we could start converting. 0% chance. Great! 0% chance. That's... That's good. That's fantastic. We can't convert them. <laughs> Fuck! We're gonna have to go the religious tree or something. Alright, anyway, just go dock up for now. I'm not docking Ceylon. Oh. Alright, we're going to bring the funding for our troops up to a small amount. We're going to fund our navy down. We're going to send... Uh, is there a split off? No, there's no split off to protect trade. Damn it. Alright, well, I'll do it manually then. You guys are going to protect trade in Ceylon. And where's my other navy? Did, did, I think my other navy died. Yeah, it did. So, we don't have anyone protecting in Bengal, but that's fine. Oh, I don't think... Maybe, maybe we never had anyone in Bengal. I don't know. Well, anyway, are you still hostile? Yep, hostile, hostile. Everyone's fucking hostile, man. Fucking dipshits. Will you help me against Vinod? No. Who do you like more, me or Vinod? Be honest. You like Vinod a hell of a lot more than me. All right, well... Well, fuck you, too. I hate you so much. Uh, I'm going to go and uh, get relations up with you. Maybe then you'll help me. But in the meantime, in the meantime, oh my god, everyone has claims on my shit here. That's bad. Everyone's going to declare war on me. That is also bad. <laughs> oh, goodness. So bad. So very bad. You got an alliance with Bastar, who's a one province minor that no one cares about. Oh, man. This is such a nerve-wracking start. It feels like we gotta do something, but th it's like, hurry up and do nothing, you know? There's nothing to do. Uh, we could take an advisor, but I don't think our economy can really support it. How much would it cost? 1.1 uh, monthly. We could afford that. Just barely. Hmm. We do need the inflation reduction guy, because he's making everything cost more right now. Ah, uh, what else is there? Diplomatic reputation, diplomatic technology... Reinforced speed. No, I don't like any of these guys. Yeah, you're saying navies are more effective protecting trade with more funding. But that would cost me... 0 .1, 0 0.35 ducats. It doubles my naval maintenance. Uh, does it actually get me more money? I don't know. Let's see. It's at 1.54 with low maintenance. Let's see how high it goes with with good maintenance. We'll wait a whole month. It goes up to 1.68. So the increase in trade uh, goes up by 0.14, but the increase in cost goes up by 0.17. So it actually costs more to fund it, so fuck it. It's cheaper. Uh, we can't vassalize anyone, unfortunately, because everyone's hostile or, um, or a rival. If they're hostile or a rival, then you can't do anything like get married or get alliances or anything. See, we are kind towards Karnatik because we consider them a friend who might help us against Madurai. Uh, but they don't see, they don't feel it the same way. So they just don't. Same thing with Bijapur, Hostel, Amednagar. Well, Amednagar might be good. Who are you at war with? Amewat and Molten? Over what? Defender against Mewat in the Mawadi conquest of Dundar. Where the fuck is Dundar? Oh, it's not even your province. It's someone else. Oof.
We're going to save up some admin points and get this shit converted to a core. And then we'll see if with the core, let's see if that'll help us uh, convert them. We do have war exhaustion we should get rid of. There you go. I wish I could manage this over extinction. <laughs> oh, goodness. Come on, give me some more points. Someone's fabricating claims. Madurai is fabricating claims on me. God damn it. Well, I hope Arissa would help us in a defensive war, because we might need their assistance, like, super quickly here. Uh, let me get my troops home to Ceylon. I don't feel comfortable being uh, right next to Madurai with my troops. Oh my god. Pick my ships and dock up. Thank you. I really feel like Carnatic would be useful, but uh, they're hostile. It's just not going to work. It doesn't tell you why they're hostile, but I assume it's just because we're a different religion. That's that's their main problem. Problem? Form a vassal in the conquered land. You mean release them as a vassal? Uh, and then just annex them later? What would be the benefit of doing that? Yeah, Ceylon's one province. What would be the benefit of releasing them as a vassal? Annex Ming, I'll get right on that. Well, before we do anything, why am I going, before we do anything, let me go ahead and get my core here. It's going to be a couple more months. Oh, we can't. Why can't we make it a core? Oh, it's too far away. Are you kidding me? <laughs> this, it's right next door, but it's apparently too far away to get a core. You're shitting me. <laughs> oh. That is so bad. We can't do anything over there. Yeah, we're just going to make him a vassal. That is so dumb. Okay, there you go. New vassal. Hooray! And they hate our guts. Uh, they're the wrong religion, but whatever. Uh, they don't even want a marriage, even though they're a vassal. Distance between borders, negative 10,000. Let's see if that changes after a month. Apparently not. Oh, now they do. Okay, yeah. It's just because they were freshly spawned. I, I hate how things like that happen. It should, it should run the check for that right away, not later on. Anyway... We have a vassal. Uh, we should probably boost relations if possible. Uh, and they have rivals. Let's uh, let's get a similar rival. We'll take uh, Vinod, sure. There you go. That'll boost relations a bit. Apparently not at all. It didn't it didn't boost relations at all. It boosted it on my end, but not their end. Hmm. All right. Whatever. Uh, get relations up, and they can get their own army going. We'll still get a little bit of money out of them. That's good. I think that's a great idea. I can't believe we can't even put a core over there. That is insane. <laughs> oh. Yeah, we're not going to do anything with Malabar, so we might as well um, just tell him to fuck off. Uh, do we need Vaginagar? No, we'll, do, we'll keep Bengal. We don't need Vaginagar as a rival. So we'll get rid of that. And we'll put uh, Malabar over there. Malabar. Merlebur. Bingo. If these guys will stop being hostile, I would love to ally with Carnatic. That'd be great. Either them or Bijapur, but preferably Carnatic, because they actually have two provinces that are congruent and not, you know, 
separated. <laughs> Go for Vinod, I would love to, but um, they are still allied with Orissa, and I don't think Orissa would help us, unfortunately. Even though we have a positive 200, they're still like, nah. Alright, we're going to wait two more months, and then we're going to get our diplomat back from Orissa. We'll see if uh, Orissa would help us in that war with Vinod. It's a definite maybe, but I think no. Uh, because they still like Vinod at 195. We're at 200, but they're at 195, so I'm, I don't think they will. We'll take a look, though. Worth a look. Nope. What about Malabar? You help me against Malabar? We don't have any claims over there, do we? Can't get one either, can we? Nope. We do have two claims over here. Would you help me against these guys? Yes. Okay, you would help me against them. Do you have a bigger army? You do. You have six grand. Okay. So this can be done. We have two claims here. You have six grand. You have... Do you have an ally? You have no allies. All right. Yeah. Come on, Arissa. It will be glorious. Let us go. Uh, I want Coromandel more than anything. Yes. And, of course, our vassal will help. Uh, do you have any boats? I don't think you have any boats. Let me take a quick look. Actually, I can probably tell this from the war screen, right? Yeah, they have no boats. Okay, so we can blockade them safely. Uh, you can get on the boat. We can fund our military. Oh, this is great. Fund the Navy a tiny bit. And they're going to go fight. I would love to help them, but I'm not sure we could actually defeat them. Uh, they're going to go to Kongu. You're going to be safe, but then you're going to be trapped in Kongu. Ah, whatever. We'll just help Arissa when Arissa shows up. I don't really care about my vassal's silly little army. Oh, they have rebels. <laughs> so Arissa can't even get here. Nope, they're just standing away. They're like, well, there's rebels in the way. I didn't even know there was rebels here. That means we can't actually do this shit. Uh, but if he's going to go siege my vassal, then let's go down here real quick. Uh, lose admin or lose what? Legitimacy. Uh, we'll lose the admin. I don't want to lose legitimacy. I like legitimacy. It's great. Alright, we're actually still making a tiny bit of money with our troops fully funded. That's great. That means I should get a couple more dudes. Let's take some elephants. And hopefully with them blockaded, this might follow a little more quickly. Ha! He recruited somebody. Gotcha, bitch. Dead. Nice. Alright, take that shit out. Hopefully those rebels will just go away. I mean, I don't know what they're doing. Uh, we're losing a little bit of money now. That's not good. But whatevs. And he's actually sieging faster than I am.